the 64th annual Primetime Emmy Awards. The Emmys are the Oscars of television. And there was a long list of British actors and shows nominated for TV awards. Even the host had noticed. Television is an American institution, and yet one out of every five acting nominees tonight is British, which I don't understand. I guess we're supposed to reward them because their actors went to the Royal Shakespeare Academy and ours were discovered at the mall. And one of them won big with Best Dramatic Actor. And the Emmy goes to Damien Lewis. Um, hello, everybody. I, uh, I'm Damien Lewis. I'm one of those pesky Brits. Uh, apologies. Um, I don't really believe in judging art, but I thought I'd show up just in case. <laughs> Turned out all right. Um, For the last time, Carrie, I am not what you think I am. Homeland scooped four top drama prizes, best series, best writing, and best actress for Claire Danes. And in the best miniseries or TV film category, there were some familiar British faces. Clive Owen, Hemingway and Yalhorn, Benedict Cumberbatch, Sherlock, A Scandal in Belgravia, Idris Elba, Luther. But it was another big-name movie star who walked away with a gold. This is the first Emmy win for Kevin Costner. Is there any news of Sybil? She's still not coming. She All eyes had been on Downton Abbey. This year's 16 nominations adding up to make it the Emmy's most shortlisted British show ever. The family must never be a topic of conversation. Maggie Smith won Best Supporting Actress in a Drama, but the show missed out in the other main categories. And it wasn't the year for 60s ad agency drama Mad Men, which was beaten to what would have been a record five wins in a row. And its lead, John Hamm, was again overlooked. There was a comedy scrum as Jon Stewart won his 10th in a row, best variety, music or comedy series for the satirical news program The Daily Show, as his competitors held him back from collecting the prize once again. And sweeping the boards in the comedy category was Modern Family, best show, best directing and best supporting actor and actress. Britain had a high profile night at the best of American TV awards, even if it didn't come home with much gold. Alice Lee, BBC News, Hollywood.